African countries that have launched their own satellite. Hello, the Explorers. Welcome back to another informative video presented to you by the Explorer, and thanks for watching. In this video, we shall be presenting to you all the African countries that have successfully launched their own satellite in space. A satellite is an artificial body placed in an orbit around the Earth or the Moon or another planet in order to collect information or for communication. More than 1,950 active satellites are currently orbiting Earth, and plenty more could soon be joining them. In the modern world, technology has become a key factor in development. Therefore, with a satellite in space, a country is known to have made great strides. Space has become an attractive frontier for African countries that have launched satellites based on scientific, technological, or military ambitions. The Soviet Union was the first country in the world to launch the world's first artificial satellite into orbit, and it's a step many African countries are emulating. 41 African satellites have now been launched in Africa, and 38 of them are from individual countries, while three were multilateral efforts. Unfortunately, none of those launches has taken place from African soil. While local engineers and scientists are often involved in the development of satellites, cooperation with other countries such as China, Russia, and Japan has historically been necessary to successfully launch satellites into space. If you are new here, welcome. Be sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss any of our daily uploads. The enthusiasm around space technology also comes from the recognition that information gleaned from satellites has the potential to improve agriculture, guard against deforestation, improve disaster planning, and provide internet to rural communities. The current investments can also offset the long-term cost of purchasing and maintaining satellites from foreign governments. As such, several African nations have manufactured, launched, and operated their own programs to power their own scientific, technological, and military ambitions. Amongst them, here are the African countries with a presence in space. Number 1. South Africa The South African National Space Agency, SANSA, is South Africa's government agency responsible for the promotion and development of aeronautics and aerospace research. It fosters cooperation in space-related activities and research in space science, seeks to advance scientific engineering through human capital, as well as the peaceful use of outer space, and supports the creation of an environment conducive to the industrial development of space technologies within the framework of national government. In 1999, South Africa launched its first satellite, SunSat from Vandenberg Air Force Base in the US. A second satellite, Sumbandilasat, was launched from the Baikonur Cosmodrome in Kazakhstan in 2009. In December 2018, South Africa launched the continent's most advanced nanosatellite into space to monitor and manage disasters such as fires and assist the ocean economy. The Zacube 2, a 10 kg nanosatellite, provides state of the art remote sensing and communication services to South Africa and the Southern African region, according to DEC Central. The satellite was launched in Russia. The as part of the Russian Soyuz Kanopus mission and is the most advanced satellite in Africa. That is the second government-owned nanosatellite South Africa has launched into space. The first was the TPSOSAT, which was launched in 2013, according to SASTA. Number 2. Nigeria Along with South Africa, Nigeria's space program is more advanced than in its African peers. Nigeria has launched four satellites into space, with three still operational and one deorbited after completing its objectives. Nigeria launched its first Earth observation satellite, Nigeria Sat 1, in September 2003 by Cosmos 3M rocket from Russian Platsex spaceport, which cost the country $30 million. That was followed by the launch of Africa's first communication satellite, Nichecom Sat 1, built and launched in China in 2007. Earth observation satellites Nigeria Sat 2 and Nigeria Sat X were then sent into the orbit by the Ukrainian Dnepr rocket from Yasny military base in Russia on August 17, 2011. These have been used to monitor activities of terrorist group Boko Haram and to monitor weather in a region seasonally ravaged by disasters. Nigeria collaborated with UK engineers on the project, and the satellites are being monitored from control stations in Guildford, UK, and in Abuja, Nigeria. The satellites could also provide Nigeria with the ability to enhance food security through monthly crop monitoring, assist with burgeoning urban planning demands, and through the development of engineering skills, advance the country's technological capability too. Both satellites were built at Surrey Satellite Technology Limited in Guildford, 
under contract with the Nigerian National Space Research and Development Agency. But 26 Nigerian engineers worked alongside SSTL engineers in Guilford to assemble the 100 kg Nigerasat X satellite. Number 3. Egypt Egypt launched its first telecommunication satellite Tiba 1 from the South American base of French Guiana on the evening of 26 November 2019 at 11 pm. The launch was due to take place on the 15th of November, but it was postponed on the 25th November. The launch was further postponed for another 24 hours due to bad weather conditions. Tiba 1 is planned to operate for more than 15 years, providing broadband internet services to individuals and businessmen in Egypt, as well as other North African and now Basin countries. Before this one, four private NASA satellites were launched into an orbit as communication satellites between 1998 and 2010. In addition, Egypt had launched three government-owned satellites into space, of which only one is operational. In February 2019, the Egypt Sat A High Resolution Earth Observation Satellite was launched into space. It was developed by Russian Corporation RSC Energia on behalf of Egypt's National Authority of Remote Sensing and Space Sciences, according to Space Flight. That satellite was replacement for the Egypt Sat 2, an imaging satellite built by the RSC Energia that launched in April 2014. It was lost later that month due to a flight control system failure and was replaced by the Russian company in 2019. The Egypt Sat 1 Egypt's first Earth remote sensing satellite was built jointly by Egypt's National Authority for Remote Sensing and Space Sciences and the Usnoi Design Bureau in Ukraine. It was launched in 2007 but communication and control of the satellite was lost in 2010. Number 4. Angola Angola's first satellite, Angosat-1, was launched late December 2017, but declared defunct by Russia four months later because the project had several technical issues after launch. The Angosat-1, a communication satellite built for almost $300 million, was launched from the Baikonur Cosmodrome in Kazakhstan. The Russian company RSC Energia, which brought the satellite on behalf of Angola, committed to building a more powerful replacement at no cost, thanks to Anglosat 1's insurance policy, according to Al Jazeera. About 50 Angolan aerospace engineers were trained around the world and were supposed to oversee the mission from a control center in Angola. Anglosat 2, the country's second national telecommunication satellite, is 50% completed and will finish before the end of 2020 as it is scheduled. Number 5. Algeria The Alcom Sat-1 was the first satellite launched by Algeria and it was done in collaboration with China and has since become one of the most active African countries in space technology as Algeria has six satellites in orbit. The most recent launch was in 2017 when the Algerian Space Agency launched a telecom satellite into space in cooperation with China. The Alcom Sat-1 which began operating in 2018 supports TV broadcasting and provides broadband communications for education, e-government, and other services, according to IT Web Africa. In September 2016, three Algerian satellites, Alsat-1B, Alsat-2B, and Alsat-1N were launched by an Indian Polar Satellite Launch, in cooperation with Indian Space Research Organization. Number 6. Ethiopia Ethiopia's first satellite in space was launched in China in October 2019, with the help of China and was sent into space, a landmark achievement for the ambitious country that also caps a banner year for Africa's involvement in space. A Chinese Long March 4B rocket hoisted the first Ethiopian remote sensing satellite called ETRSS-1 aloft from the Taiwan space base in northern China. Scores of Ethiopian and Chinese officials and scientists gathered at the Intonto Observatory and Research Center outside the capital Addis Ababa to watch a live broadcast. The 70 kg satellite was developed by the Chinese Academy of Space Technology with the help of 21 Ethiopian scientists. China has also currently paid $6 billion of the $8 billion expense to build and launch a second Ethiopian communication satellite in space. Number 7. Ghana Ghana's first satellite, GhanaSat-1, was launched into orbit in 2017 from the International Space Station developed by students at All Nations University in Koforidua, Ghana. The satellite launch was a two-year project costing $500,000 according to BBC. The successful project was supported by the Japanese Space Agency, which also helped launch Kenya's first satellite in 2018. Cheers erupted as 400 people, including the engineers, 
gathered in the Southern Ghanaian city to watch live pictures of the launch and the first signal was received shortly afterwards. The satellite was used to monitor Ghana's coastline for mapping purposes and to build capacity in space science and technology. Richard Damore, director of the Space Systems Technology Laboratory at the All Nations University, said it marked a new beginning for the country. Number 8. Kenya Kenya joins the list of African nations with space ambitions, launching its home design satellite on May 11, 2018. The CUBE satellite was launched from the Japanese model of the International Space Nation and was brought there by a SpaceX record during an April resupply mission. The CUBE satellite is utilized in various sectors, including weather forecasting, food security mapping, livestock and wildlife monitoring, besides disaster management. The nano-satellite designed by the Kenyan scientists at the University of Nairobi was developed as part of a joint program between the United Nations and Japanese Space Agency to support research institutions from developing countries to manufacture and improve their own space technology. This was not in fact Kenya's first satellite. In 1970, it launched Uhuru from Malinde, southeastern Kenya, which was the world's first Earth-orbiting mission dedicated to celestial X-ray astronomy. But according to a Vice article, the program did not benefit many Kenyans. For Kenya, the deployment of the satellite heralds a historic moment, especially as it competes with neighboring nations like Ethiopia, which aim to have become a scientific herb and have already funded a multi-million dollar space observatory and research center. But that competitive gap could only be closed to the government allocating more money for research and development activities and stopping advanced expertise from leaving the country, a step Kenyan officials are now undertaking. Number 9. Morocco In late 2018, Morocco launched its surveillance satellite, the Mohamed 6B, from the spaceport in French Guiana in cooperation with French company Ariane Space. A Vega launcher lifted off from a spaceport at the edge of South America's Amazon rainforest, climbed into orbit on the par of four Italian and Ukrainian belt rocket stage, and successfully deployed French belt Moroccan owned military surveillance satellite, nearly 400 meters above Earth. The spy satellite named Mohammed 6B for the nation's king is 30 meters tall. This was definitely the second launch after the first successful one of Mohammed 6A launched in 2017. The Mohammed 6A satellite was launched from Kourou in French Guinea on a Vega rocket built by Airbus Defense in Space and Thales Alenia Space. Number 10. Rwanda Rwanda first launched its own satellite on the 26th of February 2019, which was a big step in joining the myriads of countries who already enjoyed the satellite in orbit. Working with the UK-based company OneWeb, it launched iSeries Zeko, the first ever satellite that connects remote school students at Nkombo Island in Kivu to the internet, which will bridge internet connection in rural areas around the country. OneWeb is a global communication firm which seeks to deliver connectivity for everyone, everywhere, through a global satellite constellation, through its founder, Greg Weiler. The satellites were not launched in Rwanda because satellites are normally launched by the sea to minimize risk, and this launch was a partnership. The Rwandan government has always sought the use of technology to solve the challenges the country faces. Rwanda was the first country in the world to use drones to transport blood to remote clinics. The launch of iSeries Eco has far more reaching impacts than just internet access. Rwanda's ICT and Education Master Plan outlines ambitions of interventions to connect schools and empower Rwandan children with immense opportunity, notably research, support our competence-based learning, ease to access and share digital content, support systems to monitor and evaluate progress, among others. Rwanda plans to have its second satellite in orbit in July, called RUASAT. The RUASAT is expected to launch into lower orbit and is made by Tokyo University in partnership with a team of 15 Rwandan engineers. The Rwandan satellite will be used in agricultural development, as this is Africa reports. There you have it, the explorers. Those were the top African countries that have launched their own satellite. Thanks for watching this video. If you want us to cover any of your top 10 topics, leave a suggestion in the comment section and we will do well to grant your request. Also, if you did enjoy the video, do want to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and share with your friends.